hello everyone to know the uh, difference between a load combination and a repeat load case uh, i created a, a portal frame a simple for portal frame uh, like this and uh, two bracings one uh, this one and uh, the other one is this and i defined these two bracings as uh, tension only members so these two members are defined as tension only members means it will take only tension and uh, i created two load cases here this is uh, load case one uh, 10 kN load in this direction 10 kN in positive x direction and the load case two 10 kN in negative x direction at this point so after that i created a load combinations uh, these two loads acting together and the last one is a repeat load case same uh, two loads acting simultaneously so we can run the analysis and see how the behavior of the structure is we can uh, go to post processing mode and we can see the axial forces in that uh, structure fx right so this is for uh, load case 1 so the expected behavior is right means 10 kN load when you are applying here this member subjected to tension that bracing member subjected to tension and when in the second load when you applied uh, 10 kN load in this direction it is expected to uh, this member expected to get tension and uh, when it is a load combinations what is happening if we are applying the uh, uh, the load 10 kN load here and another 10 kN load here so uh, realistically uh, these two forces should cancel each other and the bracing member should get zero forces but in load combinations it's not coming properly uh, it is because in load combinations uh, the program uh, simply add the uh, algebra algebraically add the uh, forces in the particular particular load cases but in a repeat load case if you examine the repeat load case the behavior of the uh, structure behavior of the mem uh, members are perfectly okay when you are applying 10 kN load here and another 10 kN load here these two uh, the forces the axial forces in these two members are getting cancelled and it is zero only here so this is the correct behavior so unlike uh, load combination repeat load case it's a primary load case itself so in that rep uh, particular repeat load case whatever the uh, load cases which is acting simultaneously uh, means when you go to uh, loading and then you can examine this repeat load case so here uh, load case 1 and 2 uh, now it's acting so this analysis will be performed as a primary load case itself not as a load combination so at that time uh, this structure is subjected to uh, both the load cases at same simultaneously means load case 1 and load case 2 uh, is acting on the structure simultaneously and analysis will be performed so you will get the actual result exact result at that time uh, that is the reason uh, we say whenever attention members or compression members are there in the structures we need to be more careful with the load combinations instead of load combination uh, it's better to go with repeat load case again uh, whenever we are uh, doing a second order analysis or a non-linear analysis uh, repeat load cases is mandatory requirement in uh, stack thank you